Okay, dive buddies. Um, looks like we're on a mission for some serious relaxation today. Oh, yeah. You know the kind that just melts away stress and leaves you feeling like a puddle of tranquility? Mm. And judging by all this research you sent over about massage chairs and hot tubs, yeah. you're serious about this. Absolutely. You're not messing around. Right. So that's where our deep dive comes in. Yeah. We're going to break it all down for you, tailored to your needs. Sounds good. So let's start by just unpacking what we're even talking about here. Okay. What are the contenders? Mm. So first up, we've got massage chairs. Yeah, you're kind of like personal at-home relaxation guru. Right, like ready at a moment's notice. Exactly. No need to like yeah. fill a tub, wait for it to heat up. Right. You just kind of sink into that ergonomic embrace. Yeah. Press a button, then bam. Oh, my God. Targeted relief. Right. Right where you need it. And speaking of targeted relief, that's a huge point for massage chairs. Yeah. They excel at zeroing in on those like specific aches, like yeah. that one knot in your shoulder. Yeah. It's like a laser guided relaxation beam. Absolutely. Like having a personal masseuse on call 247, mm -hmm. but without the awkward small talk yeah. or the need to tip. Exactly right. Just yeah. pure relaxation on demand. I love that. And what's so cool is like the level of customization you get now with massage chairs. Oh, yeah. Like you want to really work on that lower back tension. Mm -hmm. You go for a shiatsu massage. Yep, yep. You're really craving something a little gentler for like sore shoulders. Mm. Swedish massage to the rescue. There you go. You've got it all right there at your fingertips. It's like having a whole menu of massage styles and you're just like, Picking okay. and choosing. Yeah. Okay, so let's switch gears for a second and talk about hot tubs. Okay. Because they bring a whole other vibe to the relaxation party. Oh, for sure. <laughs> Absolutely. So... If a massage chair is like that precise targeted treatment, yeah. a hot tub is like total immersion therapy. Yeah. You're enveloped in this warmth. The buoyancy of the water is just taking pressure off your joints. Oh, yeah. And those hydro jets are working their magic. Okay, pause for a second because we have to talk about the hydrotherapy aspect yeah. because it's not just about feeling good. Right. It's actually incredibly therapeutic. Yeah. Especially for joint pain. Hmm. Think about it. The water supports your weight. It eases pressure on your joints. Absolutely. Allows you to move more freely. It could be a game changer for some people. Totally. Especially, you know, if you're dealing with chronic pain. Right. And just imagine, like, soaking in that warmth after a long day. Oh, yeah. Feeling that tension melt away mm. in your lower back, your hips, your knees. It's just that feeling of weightlessness <laughs> right. that you oh. just can't get anywhere else. Totally. And then you add in the social aspect. Right, Because yeah. a hot tub, it's not just for you by yourself. No, it's not. It's practically an invitation Yeah. to get friends and family to join the party. It's like the ultimate backyard hangout spot. Exactly. Right. Stargazing deep conversations. Yeah. Maybe glassed of something bubbly. Oh, right. It's a different kind of unwinding. Totally. It's about connection. It's about shared experience. Right. So we've got our focus massage gurus in one corner. Yes. And we've got our full body social immersion specialists in the other. Yeah. It's a tough choice. Tough choices, right? It is. Big decision. Before we jump to any conclusions. Yeah. I think we need to kind of delve into some of the the details here. Yes. We need to get into the nitty gritty. A little bit. Yeah. We're talking long term costs. Yes. Maintenance. Yeah. How these relaxation havens actually fit into your life. Real world stuff. Right. So we'll be back in a flash to unpack all of that. So don't go anywhere. All right. So we're back and ready to put these relaxation rivals head to head. Yeah, let's do it. Last time we really explored massage chairs and hot tubs as like individual contenders. Right. But now it's time to see how they actually stack up against each other in a few key categories. Okay. That's good. So think of this as our relaxation showdown. Yeah. Where we really weigh the pros and the cons to help you decide which one comes out on top for your needs. I like it. Okay. Round one, convenience. Right. So when you're craving relaxation, like, how much effort are you really willing to put in? Right, because that's the beauty of a massage chair. Yeah. It's always ready to go. Yeah. You don't need to change clothes. Yeah. You don't need to, like, prep the backyard or wait for anything to heat up. Right. You just walk in. Yeah. Press start. Let the stress melt away. Exactly. Point goes to the massage chair for just pure ease of use. Definitely. Okay, but what about when we're talking about targeting those really specific aches and pains mm -hmm. like that one stubborn knot in your shoulder oh yeah that you just can't seem to get rid of well i think that's where like those customizable massage styles in those chairs really shine you know we're talking about everything from like gentle kneading to 
really intense shiatsu. Yeah. All designed to really pinpoint your problem areas. Oh, uh, yeah. It's like having a team of massage therapists yeah. at your beck and call. Right. And you get to decide, I want this one today. That's right. Okay. Oh, that's a tough one to beat. Yeah. But I don't want to completely count out hot tubs because there is something to be said about that unique full body bliss. Oh, absolutely. Of a hot tub. Yeah. Like it's not just about relaxation. It's about that feeling of weightlessness. Yeah. You know, the warmth enveloping your entire body. Yeah, it's just a completely different feeling. It is. Like being immersed in that warm water. Yeah. And having those jets just gently massage your muscles. Right. It's incredibly soothing, mm -hmm. especially for anyone with joint pain. Oh, for sure. You know, think about how good it feels to just like take the weight off your joints after a long day. Absolutely. Just that feeling of like being suspended. Right. In the water. That you're floating almost. Yeah. You're floating almost. Yeah, exactly. Okay. And let's not forget the hot tubs aren't just about like solo relaxation. Oh, no, they're social. They're a thing. For sure. You know, you can be chatting with friends, enjoying a drink under the stars. Absolutely. It's a whole experience. Yeah. It's a different kind of unwinding. It is. More about like connection and shared experience. Yes. Very much so. Okay. So while we're on the topic of different experiences, let's talk customization. Okay. Because with a massage chair, you're really in control. You are. Like you're in the driver's seat. Yeah. You're picking the massage style, the intensity, the specific areas you want to target. Right. They've got that memory function. Right. So it remembers your preferences. It's like building your own like personalized massage program. Exactly. What about hot tubs? Can ah. you customize those too? You can, uh, I mean, maybe you don't have as many like massage options as you do with the chair. Right. But you can adjust the water temperature. You can control the jet pressure. You can even add aromatherapy scents for like a really luxurious soak. Ooh, I love that aromatherapy angle. Oh yeah, it's a game changer. Okay, so maybe it's a tie yeah. for customization. Huh. They both have their own unique ways to really personalize your relaxation. Definitely. But let's get real for a moment okay, and I'm... talk about the long-term commitment here. Okay, the nitty-gritty. Because a massage chair, once you purchase it, right. it's pretty much a one-time investment. Yeah, for the most part. You plug it in and you're good to go for years. Exactly. Maybe a little cleaning here and there, but... Right, just basic upkeep. Nothing too demanding. Yeah. Hot tubs, on the other hand, they require a little more TLC. They do. You've got your heating costs, your water usage, right. and just the regular maintenance to like keep everything clean and balanced. It's like having a mini pool in your backyard, right? which, you know, can be great, Yeah, but it does come with its own set of responsibilities. For sure. So it sounds like the massage chair might be winning the easy on the wallet yeah. and the schedule award. It does seem to have the edge in that department. But you're right. However. It's about finding the right fit for you. Exactly. And that's what this is all about. And that's what this whole deep dive is about. That's right. We've weighed the pros, the cons. Yes. We've explored all these different nuances. Indeed. And now it's about helping you make the best decision for your relaxation needs. You so to... stick with us because in part three, yeah. we're going to break down which option might be your perfect match. All right, deep divers. It's decision time. It is. We've explored the ins and outs of massage chairs and hot tubs. We've really dug deep. We have. In all the details. We've looked at their strengths, mm -hmm. their quirks, yeah. even how they stack up against each other. Right. Head to head. Exactly. But at the end of the day, the real question is... What's the verdict? Which one is right for you? That's right, because there's no one right answer when it comes to relaxation. It's so personal. It really is. It's about you. Right. And what you need. Yeah. So to recap, if you're all about that, yeah. I need to unwind right now. Energy. Mm -hmm. Instant gratification. Yeah. Like I need targeted relief and I need it now. Yeah. Just that ease of use. Yeah. A massage chair might be calling your name. It might be for you, especially if you're someone who values convenience. Yes. And customization. Huge. Like you said, imagine this. You had a crazy day, mm -hmm. shoulders are tight, mm -hmm. you're stressed. Yep. Massage chair, you could be sinking into that shiatsu bliss. Oh, yeah. In minutes. So fast. No on. planning required. Just pure relaxation. Exactly. On demand. Ready to go. There you go. It's like having your own personal masseuse. It really is. Just like on standby, mm -hmm. ready to work out those knots whenever you need it. Absolutely. And let's not forget, you know, the long-term value there. Oh, yeah. So, like you said, you make that one-time purchase. Yep. And then you've got years yeah, of relaxation. At your fingertips. At your fingertips. Exactly. Without those ongoing costs of like a hot tub. Right. You know, you don't have to worry about the chemicals or yeah. the maintenance. They clean it. It's just there for you. Easy peasy. On the other hand, though, if what you're seeking yes. 
is that really immersive escape mm -hmm. that full body experience yes where you just feel the weightlessness that warmth the warmth yeah. enveloping your entire body that's where the hot tub really shines there's something magical about it it is there's no denying it right like just sinking into that yeah hot bubbly embrace like a warm hug it is and yeah. letting the water melt away the stress of the day absolutely especially if you're someone who really loves to unwind with friends and family yeah it becomes a social hub it does a place to gather yep share stories make memories connect so good so it really boils down to this. Okay, what's the bottom line? What are your priorities? Yeah. Do you prioritize that very focused on-demand relief right. of a massage chair? Okay. Or are you more drawn to that full body immersion? Yeah. And that social connection? The hot tub experience. Of a hot tub. Okay. So we've given you the lay of the land here. We have. Explored those pros and cons. Yes. We've even pitted these relaxation powerhouses against each other. It was a tough battle. It was a tough battle, but ultimately, Yes. The decision is yours. You get to choose. It's all about what resonates with you. Your vision of ultimate relaxation. Exactly. And hey. Yes. Who says you can't have both? Ooh, I like where you're going with this. Maybe massage chair strategically placed yes. next to your hot tub that... under the stars. Okay. Now you're talking. That's the dream. That's the ultimate relaxation oasis. Until next time, happy relaxing, everyone.